Coming up next, it's a featherweight title fight between Jose Aldo and one of the original Ultimate Fighters, Kenny Florian. Kenny Florian making his way to the world-famous octagon. Kenny Florian is a very aggressive striker, and we've seen him in many fights with those wicked elbows of his. We've also seen him win a lot with his rear naked chokes. He can finish fights quickly from any position. Kenny Florian, fired up and ready to go. Jose Aldo making his way to the octagon, and he has this crowd fired up. Jose Aldo is one of the top pound-for-pound -pound fighters to ever compete. He is a monster on the ground, has crazy knockout power on his feet, and he never seems to get tired. If there's any weaknesses in his game, we have yet to see it. Jose Aldo fired up and ready to give the crowd what they came to see. Tale of the Tape is brought to you by the only motorcycles worthy of being in the octagon, Harley Davidson. Once again, with our official introductions for this battle, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. And now, five rounds for the UFC featherweight championship of the world. Introducing first, the challenger. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall. Weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Boston, Massachusetts. Penny and Flo Warrior. And now, introducing the champion. Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Muay Thai and Jiu-Jitsu fighter. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. He is the former WEC featherweight champion. Ladies and gentlemen, he is the reigning, defending UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose. Referee in charge of this contest is Herb Dean. All right, gentlemen, this is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. Mike Goldberg alongside my partner Joe Rogan, and we are ready to get this fight started. Are you ready to fight? Kenny Florian, Jose Aldo. And here we go. Come Kenny on, Florian's go. family has always been involved in martial arts. His father studied it for many years. Kenny played tennis and soccer as a child. In fact, he received a scholarship to play soccer at Boston College and graduated with a degree in communications and filled in for you one fight and wasn't so bad, was he? No, he's actually very good, very technical. And it just shows you, uh, because of the, the, the kind of fighter he is, you know, he's, he's always breaking down opponents and looking at their strengths and weaknesses and strategy. And that's what makes him such a good commentator. He can really see what's going on and relay that information to the fans at home. Oh, big combination. Oh, good combination. And good right hand counter. Nice oh, Superman my. punch. He's got his back. Pushing him up against the cage. One. 
Single leg. Good takedown defense. Using the cage to help him. Push kick. Boom. Just over a minute remains. What an exchange here. Just about one minute remains in the first round. Both men exchanging. He caught the kick. He's got the clinch. 30 seconds remains in the round. Oh! And he slips and winds up on his back. He's got the hooks in. He's going to try to flatten out. Our first round is in the books. The crowd is on its feet. These two fighters kept it standing, and they went to war, Joe. That was a beautiful display of striking skills from both guys, Mike. That round there is why we love this sport so much. After you angle off, fire on. You own him when you spin him. You understand? When you angle off, come back right away. You got it? Angle off, come back right, come back away. right away. All right? Let's take a look at the replay of some of the action here, Mike. This was just an unbelievable counter right here. This is flawless timing. Right here, we see that tremendous counter shot land. Some very impressive striking in that round, Mike. A lot of turns. Be sharp with that. The beautiful Ariani. Are you ready to fight? Are you ready? We start round two. On, this fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. He gets the clinch here. They clinch. Back him up. Keep his head facing away. Body shot when you're in that tight. Struggling hard for the takedown. Big right hand. He's got the clinch. Relentless takedowns here. He passes to half guard and back to full guard. He's passed nice. to half guard. Moves into full mount here. If he can flatten out his opponent, Joe, he can put in a choke here with both hooks in. Oh, nice back door escape. Swing and a miss. Oh, big shot. Oh, spinning back kick. Countering and scoring big time. Huge left and right. Those are snapping his head back, Mike. Head kick. He's hurt. Him. He's got the clinch. He's hurt badly. He's down. But man, he snapped that quick. The crowd in favor of... Oh, flying knee. Punishing shots to the body. Oh, wow. looping hook there. The crowd now in favor of Jose Aldo. 30 seconds remains in the round. That one dropped him. He's hurt. He's hurt. Oh, this is ugly, Mike. It's it's over. Over. It is all over. Wow, what a performance. What a 
performance. He defends the UFC featherweight title. And that's the beginning of the end. Gets on top of him and swarms on him. Look at it from this angle. And with our official decision, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 55 seconds of the second round. Declaring the winner by TKO and still the UFC featherweight champion of the world, Jose Jr. Aldo. Jose Aldo defends the UFC featherweight title.